Social media is full of opinions and hot takes, but we verify so that we could stick just to the facts. Right now, there's a lot of talk about how much gas and oil is produced in the U.S. Biden critics are quick to write things like this. Biden needs to unleash American energy production, while Jen Psaki, his press secretary, argues that U.S. production of natural gas and oil is rising and approaching record levels. So let's verify, how much gas and oil do we produce in the U.S., and how does it compare to past years? Our sources are the Energy Information Administration and a pair of energy experts, Mark Finley from Rice University and Robert Weiner from the George Washington University. So let's get to the data. The EIA has this graph showing yearly crude oil production in the U.S. I mean, you'll see that U.S oil production peaked in the around 1970. Our two experts walked us through the data, pointing out that for some 30 years between the 70s and the 2000s, U.S. production was dropping. The United States was in steady decline because basically been drilled out. Our experts say that this all changed in the mid-2000s due to the so-called shale revolution. Techniques like hydraulic fracturing or fracking caused a huge spike in production of oil in the U.S. That shale revolution took place across successive administrations of both Democrats and Republicans. So let's get to the latest numbers. In 2021, there were over 4 billion 82 million barrels produced in the U.S. That's only lower than 2020 and the peak in 2019. Weiner says the decrease over the last two years was due to the global pandemic. With demand way down, production needed to go down also. So the oil companies produced less. They were very unprofitable. So we could verify that the U.S. production of oil and gas is down from 2019, but it's far greater than it's been for nearly all of American history. With your Verify, I'm Evan Kozloff.